Thursday at 7 o'clock in the Parkview, Newtown, we're having an event with a speaker from um, Westport, Simon Wall. Um, the event is basically to pull the community together and um, have a chat with the new residents who have moved in. We've had a lot of new housing in Newtown, and it seems like there might be more planned, and we want to pull the community together have a chat and say, look, this is how the town could be over the next 20 years. That's the name of the group is New Town 2050 is organising it. So we're looking long term and we invited um, Simon Wall down from Westport. He was the town architect in Westport when Westport started to turn around in the early 2000s. And they laid out a lot of um, the groundworks and the planning of how the town developed. So he's going to come down and talk about how they did in Westport, the tourist benefits, the financial benefits to the town and how it made Westport a success story and... We think Newtown has an amazing potential. It's a fantastic location. It's a beautiful town. It's at the foothills of the mountains. It's, you can see the sea from it. Beautiful terrain and forestry. And we want to see, right, how can we um, how can we help Newtown stay a great town and become something special? And, and Hugh, what a great town Westport to model it off. I mean, that's ambitious, though. I mean, Westport God, it has to be one of the nicest towns on the West Coast. Oh, it's a, well, it was a planned town. It's one of the few planned towns in Ireland. And, um, but, you know, if you're going to choose a model... Why not? Absolutely. And it's like Newtown is, it's got the mountains at the back of it. It's got fantastic forestry. We've got great walks and we're looking to develop more. We're close to, um, we're close to the sea. We're, we're next to the M11. We've got Dublin on our doorstep. On a good day, you know, on a Sunday, you can get into Dublin within 20 minutes. Mm. And um, uh, there's great beauty there. And Westport, I think, got it right because it reached out to the other villages as well and, and pulled the other villages into their their economic model of how the, the town will grow. We, we want to do the same. You know, we look at Newtown, Kukul, Newcastle, and Roundwood, all as one section of um, village size in the area that, you know, the schools are served, all these villages, the village infrastructure all connect these villages, and we want to try improving that and make um, make something really special. Between Bray and, and Wicklow Town are these villages, and we want to make them and keep them a great place to live and grow, you know, grow kids and, 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 and do business. Now, like many towns in the county and elsewhere, Newtown has been affected by the recession. Is that still, are the scars still there? They are, yeah, and it's not even this recession, it's the recession before as well, but it's it's turning around, and it's turning around the last 10 years, and, you know, the recession, the last session hit 10 years ago, but mm. Newtown was turning then, and the, the housing development that's gone on there had permission back then at 06, but it's only getting built now. Now, there is a lot of, you know, communication between Dublin and, and Newtown on the, on the M11, and it is it is very busy. We do have a business park in Newtown. It is starting to slowly fill up with, with new businesses, and we're hoping new businesses will come into the town. And um, I think it's turning a big corner. I think it's not only Newtown. I think Kukul is as well. I think all the villages in that, that section between Wicklow Town and, and Bray are changing and becoming much more um, independent, I should say, and employers locally. And it's not a, it's a, it used to be an agricultural economy mm -hmm. primarily. Now it's, it's much more varied. Now tell us a little bit more about this evening next week and, and if people would like to, to, to attend. So the evening, what it's about is it's a, it's not a, um, it's not a complaining evening. It's a, a positive evening saying, look, we're, we're organising this. The, um, the Parkview has given us the, the venue for, for free. Um, thank you very much, Parkview. Mm -hmm. We're hoping to have a, between three and 400 people. We have our main guest speaker, and he's going to talk about how how a town can be um, turned around from a, a stagnant town like Westport used to be into a thriving town. And the things you, you watch out for, the things you do to, to, to help it work, we're invited. I've had chats with all the, the TDs um, in Wicklow, all the councillors, and asked them to come. And it looks like they're going to get a good attendance from the political people, um, developers, business people in the town. But we're especially appealing to local groups, for instance, the you know the scouts, the GAA, the girl guides, anybody does you know the, the local karate club, anybody who has an interest in the village to come along and. Put your piece in, say, you know, we'll have an ideas box, say, if you have an idea of what you'd like to see happen in the village, and then eventually we're aiming towards the, the local area development plan, which is going to be written in late 2017, that this is how we want our village to develop. It's kind of, it's like self-empowerment, say, give, give us all your ideas. We have a forum established in, in, in Newtown. The, the forum is facilitating this. We're, we've applied for um, funding to try to get a, a town architect or an architect, external architect to come in and 
lay at her town with input from all the villagers. It's, it's not a, a business oriented thing. This is with every small group in the village to come down on Thursday night, give us ideas, listen to what the talk has to say, and then we reconvene about a month's time afterwards. Hugh Hill, thank you very much. Thank for you very much. That. And by the way, very best luck to you and everyone down in Newtown in relation to that event uh, coming up now. Plenty of GAA action uh, this Woo! weekend. My